people generally miss is it's not the women and girls who need technology as much as the technology needs them. It's the perspective of half of humanity which has been missing largely from technology development. And that's what we are after at Plugshot. We are encouraging not only uh, women uh, to be or girls to be uh, attracted and recruited into our courses, but to, there is a program where the women are reaching out to the underserved and mentoring those uh, class 12 students so that we can inspire more and more to take up STEM education and not shy away from it. that there is a leaking pipeline for women in STEM. Starting from the high school, where most of the girl students do not opt for physics, chemistry, and maths as career choices. Why? We have to make sure that we actually plug this leaking pipeline and we see more and more women actually advance in STEM careers. One of the clubs we have here at Plaksha is called JWIST, which is Girls and Women in STEM. Our goal is to have 50% representation of women by the year 2035. Currently, the representation stands at only 30%, which is still really great for engineering universities. At Plaksha, we really support inclusivity and diversity and wish to see a more diverse set of students. Yeah.